Yo, Saka Fed, I'm Sammy Beats. In this video, I'm gonna show you everything you need to know to create heavy Ama Piano Instrumental. I'm gonna do my best to keep the video under 20 minutes. First, we will see how to create the drum pattern. I will show you how to use Floaty Slice X to chop Ama Piano drum loop that already exists. This technique gonna take your Ama Piano drum to the next level. After, we'll create the melody, the log drum, and at the end, add effects and transitions. Let's have some fun. Let's set our tempo at 112 and start directly with some drums. We start like. That's it. That's the first one. Put it right there. I am going to add some effect on this one just to make it sound a little bit different. I have um uh this one called SB French JPEG. Nice. I think I'm gonna use this one too. And then the last one is gonna be this one. And right, let's go. Okay, you do the same thing, right? And then this one will go. Nice. Nice. Now we can definitely add um some shaker. I'm out this tambourine right here and combine it with a shaker. Let me use my look and add a kick. Let me use uh the first kick. Fill each first step. Nice, and now guys, we're going to use Floaty Slice X, open a new Slice X channel. Normally, when you right click and then you open with Floaty Slice X, they're gonna select some starting point for each, each percussion so that you have on your loop. So let's remove this one. Okay, I think I can do cool. This one here and this one here. Nice. And now we're going to add uh, a snare. Uh, let me use maybe too much. We go to. This wire here is the spine of our drum. That means when we are doing the arrangement, we will have this one play from start to finish. So, I use this one, I use Div, and also I might use some pack, this one. And then we add this wire. I think this one we can definitely add it on one by itself and there is another mixer preset that I have that call I think this one is cool so I'm gonna add some calls on this one instead that's more interesting Guys, I think the drums are fire. Now we jump directly to the melodies. The first instrument is gonna be um, using citrus. Um, I have a preset and pad. Let's see. Yeah, I think it's Moonway. Let's record. 
And maybe. Contact duration, start time, we leave them like they are. Contact duration, and then we make them longer. Nice, we we'll keep it like that. And the next instrument is gonna be um adding purity and go to maybe slow scent. I might use the tremolo signal. This right here, and then we go to G, we go to G, and then so comment B. Um, we start the arrangement. Comment B. Uh, make this one unique, and this one. Uh, comment B again. I'm gonna make this one unique too. Um, this one gonna be the third one, and let this one as the second one. Comment X, and then we have this one right here. Comment B. We start without those. We start only with the drum. Sorry. Comment Z. Comment X. And the next thing we're gonna start with is gonna be the part that we have. Let's use Nexus to create our first lead melody. Those lead melody gonna bring vibe to your Ama piano. So I'm gonna go to the factory preset, go to lead, and I think I'm gonna use this one. Let's go like. And then we go down one octave. Yeah. Nice, uh, we have it again. It's now time to add a bass. I am going to use a uh, toxic bio star, bio hazard, sorry, <laughs> and go to bass. Uh, I'm gonna use a preset called um, pure. Combine it with this. We have, and we go down like that. We add another flute CDX thing just to add this E flute and copy comment C, comment V. We layer it again. You see? Let me use another lead just to complete the melody that we already have i'm gonna go to lead let's use this one and go to layer let's normally i, I use only this one this layer and i remove the delay 
and let's go okay. get like that and then we have it like this and now i'm gonna use you to add another instrument i might use this preset And now we add this soft layer. Let's record again. Let's see. Nice. Maybe let me use um, this crash right here. Right when we go to four and pattern five, we're going to make it unique, and uh, I'm going to we move those melody right there just to keep it simple and then on pattern four i'm going to remove this play with the dynamic and i'm gonna add this wave station plugin by cog i'm trying this one and if i love it i'm gonna buy it there's this preset color i think eh? right click and then uh quick render as audio clip since i don't have this plugin after 20 minutes there will be no sound so i just quick render it so i can have it like that now I think I'm gonna buy this one by this weekend, the plugin, because I think I am loving it. Then we're going to use a drum field. I'm gonna go to Big Vibe. I think there is one called um, Money Bag. I'm going to use this one right here. So. So right there we will have our uh, our log drum. So I am going to customize this and then call it pattern six. Make unique. It's gonna be our pattern six. And then I have this one right here. Um, I think on pattern six I'm gonna get back with the kick. Sorry, get back with the kick. Fill each four step. And uh, uh, also. <laughs> And also, I'm going to add those melody right here. Come and see, but I can delete this one. Pattern six. And also, I'm going to delete this because I'm gonna create another lock drum pattern. So snare right here we delete this one right here and then we take this one up like that like that Okay, now we copy this same one, we pass it right here. And 
now we clone this one sorry we clone it uh what is it let me clone this right here and i'm always the sami log vibe comment c comment c comment v and then now we are like pattern this pattern we're going to turn it into another pattern uh, make it unique now we're going to create another logion pattern but first let me layer another uh base right here I think um let me use this chunky bit this one gonna add more punch to our thing okay now we're going to complete the log jump pattern normally you create your log jump pattern on eight bar not on four bars and this one on this one we're gonna do it like that and then now only we go G. Uh, let's mute those the other one. Do go do go do go do go do. We do it like do go do go do go do. Triplet right here. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun. Nice. Woo! And then now we copy this one right here. Comment V, comment V, comment V, comment V. So the only thing is like we're gonna transpose them one octave lower and that's it so now i'm just gonna take some time uh play with the gangster gen and make sure that everything sounds nice and then i'ma play the final vibe for you. it is a vibe guys so yeah let me do that off camera and then get back with the final vibe enjoy That's it thanks for watching i hope you enjoyed the video don't forget every drum sample that i was today or from the afrobeat essential bundle volume 2 it's gonna be out tomorrow the link is gonna be in the description box please go check it out guys if you have questions please leave a comment down below see you in the next one